name is Chris Frisch, Technical Support Specialist with Jscape. In this video we are going to be discussing how to set up the AFTP protocol in Jscape MFT server and connecting to it with Jscape AnyClient. Accelerated File Transfer, or AFTP, is a unique product from Jscape. The most common and popular file transfer protocols like FTP, SFTP, and HTTP are TCP-based protocols that meet the common file transfer needs. AFTP, on the other hand, was designed when the most common protocols just can't cut it. AFTP is a UDP-based protocol that can accelerate file transfers over long distances or even poor connections up to a hundred times faster than the standard protocols. So let's begin. The first thing we need to do is enable the AFTP service in Jscape MFT server. So let's click on the services node and click add. We will select the service type of AFTP from the drop down menu and we will enter the host IP address of our server. And take note that AFTP uses port 3000 by default. You can change the port number here, but bear in mind that Jscape any client defaults to port 3000 for AFTP as well. We're going to leave it port 3000 for the sake of this tutorial, but something else to keep in mind is that you'll also need to open port 3000 on your firewall on your server, as well as an appliance firewall if you have one implemented. So we'll click OK and click Apply. And enabling this service requires the server to restart. When you click OK here, the server will restart and AFTP will be enabled. So now we are going to switch over to Jscape AnyClient. And here we are in AnyClient. We're going to click on File and click on Site Manager. And what we're going to do is to create a new connection, we're going to create a new site. So we click New. We have a new site here, and we're just going to give it a simple name of AFTP. And now we'll click on the General tab, and on the Protocol drop-down, we're going to select AFTP. And as you can see, the settings change when you select a new protocol. So we're just going to enter the server IP address of Jscape MFT server, defaults to port 3000. And I'm going to enter the username and password that I have set up on Jscape MFT server for us to log into. At this point, we have enough settings filled out to go ahead and connect to our service. There are a few other options here you can configure, including upload rate, download rate. You can enable or disable congestion control as well. So now we are connected to the AFTP service, and we can now upload, download, move, and delete files this user has access to, and we can do everything we normally can do with FTP. The only difference is that now with AFTP, we can send and receive files up to 100 times faster over long distances and over high latency connections, such as connections that transverse satellite or transcontinental links, or even low-speed DSL links that suffer from high latency. AFTP is a powerful tool, and Jscape can help you use it to meet your business needs. For more information on Jscape MFT Server, Jscape AFTP Protocol, or Jscape AnyClient, please visit jscape.com. Thanks for watching.